Hey you guys, this is Mr. Sal. This is a vertex uh, problem. We're just going to find the vertex of this quadratic function. Uh, sorry we didn't get to this in the class, but I hope the video helps you guys out. If it helps, please hit that like button and as usual, subscribe. But that is your choice, alright? So I, I'm going to move in directly and use that formula. So I'm going to replace the b with the b value, which in this case is 6. And I'll go ahead and replace the a value with negative. So looking at that thing, that gave us a negative 6 over 2 times a negative 3, which would be a negative 6 over, a, well, negative 6, which would just make that a positive 1. So in my vertex, I can see my x value is 1. And then I'm just going to go ahead and replace all the x values in the original function with 1, because now I'm looking for f of 1. So that would be a negative 3 times a 1 squared plus 6 times 1 and then finally plus 4. So what does this give us? This gives us a negative 3 plus 6 plus 4 and that would give us a total of 7. So that's the y value in our vertex.